St. Louis Public School District has announced Central Visual and Performing Arts High School students will return to in-person learning in 10 days. When they go back on January 17th, they'll be greeted by an incredible new graffiti display in a new environment. Fox 2 Shirley Washington explains. We wanted to find a way to give back. Brock Seals is an artist with a clear mission. Use art to help students, teachers, and administrators at Central Visual and Performing Arts High School heal. Create some type of new normal safe space for them since they will have to go back to the same school. The same school where a gunman claimed the lives of a student and a teacher October 24th before he was killed by police. It was horrible. There's no other way to put it. It was, it was a terrible day. Seals and fellow artists painted powerful masterpieces on the lockers that lined the halls of the school. We all created murals that kind of centered around love, happiness, peace, um, prominent figures, you know, that people can relate to. Dion Moore painted legendary singer Nina Simone and used her hit song, Feeling Good, as her muse. So I wanted them to understand, uh, you know, when I'm coming back in here, I'm going to feel good while I'm in here. I'm going to use these words to inspire me. She also created an image of human rights activist Malcolm X. I wanted them to understand that we need this education. We need to push forward no matter what obstacles we are facing. Dave Ruggeri's message of peace, simple yet powerful, was created with all of the students in the district in mind, including his own. I have two kids that are in city schools. Any little thing we can do to try to help the kids adjust back and to uh, you know, kind of make them uh, move on from the, the events that happened, I was happy to be part of. When students return to CVPA, they will be greeted by these amazing works of art designed to help them feel as safe and as comfortable as possible.